seal. Simon, tell me an interesting fact about leather seals. Well, they're the second largest seal in the Antarctic, not the other seal. So we are down at Komiki Beach and we're going to go and check out the leopard seal which apparently is here. Quite rare to see in Cape Town. Indeed. Very cool to see a leopard seal. Um, quite small, uh, very skinny. Uh, quite a number of people, lots of enthusiasm, people watching, uh, taking great pictures and uh, yeah, a little bit of a problem with the dogs I think, but the shark spotter guys are doing a really, really great job um, and yeah, just really interesting to see. Moon's coming out now, so we'll head home. Tell us about this kelp. <laughs> well, it washes up a lot in winter after a big storm. Uh, it's often cleaned off on the city beaches, so you don't notice it. It's a very strong and pungent odor, <laughs> which is a very distinctive West Coast smell once you're used to it. Uh, I wouldn't call it a good smell though. Uh, it's absolutely stinking oh, tonight. Oh my god. <laughs> Apparently Simon doesn't mind it. I find it repulsive. You know what, for me the very first whale straining I ever went to, the whale was surrounded by this stuff. My head was very strongly associated with the smell of dead whale and the smell of thick dead cup. And blue cheese, right? No, blue cheese is more feeding whale. Oh, okay, just well, checking. The French film crew called it good cheese. Yeah. <laughs>